I found the most interesting thing here is the choice of image they've used here. Now, most of you guys listening, if you were to scroll through this page, you would probably not even look twice at the image they chose to just put next to their, uh, their landing page here. But you've got to think, we've got an image here of basically a happy couple, right? Both of them are basically models. You know, they are, they are above average attractiveness, basically. They are not average people. They're not overweight. They're attractive people, the girl and the guy. Um, now, I just want you to stop for a second and think, what does uh, antivirus have to do with having a happy relationship? How did they make that link? You know, it, it's a very, if you stop and think about it, it's a very strange image to have. I mean, what does antivirus have to do with having a happy relationship? You know, so they've managed to link the antivirus into a lifestyle and even to, into aspirations of romance, right? Um, which is a very strange thing for an antivirus to be doing, but obviously quite effective as well. Um, because this, you will, you will not really notice this, but it will change what we call your buying mood. Okay, you'll be, you'll be more motivated to buy, especially on a subconscious level. And you'll feel like, yeah, this is the right thing to be doing. You know, it's a positive thing. It's a great image to put there. And of course, here we've got, um, they're happy to say it was made in Germany because Germany has a good reputation for technology and cars. So, so of course, they're going to put that there. Um, they've got the trust pilot reviews here. And you always want testimonials from, uh, from people. Um, now, they would have handpicked which testimonials they put up the front. But you want what we call social proof to say uh, to have all these other people who have downloaded it and recommend it i guess it's pretty obvious but but it's called social proof and it's very important to have this on your landing page um uh yeah okay and here we have the next image here once again we have another model in the advert and she is smiling you know as if you know <laughs> i don't know what she's so happy about but I guess she's happy to be downloading a Vera antivirus. You know, uh, you would never see, for example, a model uh, frowning or looking upset or just looking blank. Uh, of course, they have to be smiling, which is a bit, you know, this is not really what people do in real life. Um, now, next up, we have uh, Avast, which is another well-known uh, antivirus. But again, the choice of image is really interesting. So. This top image here is actually something I'm not really too sure about. I mean, certainly everybody in the image looks good and they're well dressed and everything, but they're playing a video game. I'm not really, I couldn't really get my head around why they've chosen that image. Maybe there's something I'm missing, uh, but they are all very well dressed and dressed in a middle class kind of uniform. Um, Cloud light award winning free protection sounds fantastic good good uh, good copy there good choice of words and as with all the antivirus they have the awards recognized as the most important anti-malware institute awards certified it's really good for them to have these stamps on the page now look at this image here once again we've got the insanely happy couple uh again once again what does romance have to do with antivirus you know nothing uh, but again they, it's a really it seems to be effective in in trying to kind of linking r the idea of uh, romantic aspirations to downloading antivirus as if I think it's something to do with like uh, it, com it makes you feel like a responsible person and because you're a responsible person you will it'll be easier for you to find a partner something like that obviously we have this guy here wearing the demon jacket glasses cool hair um multicultural right but attract two attractive people as usual two models um you would never see this girl with a broken tooth or yellow teeth or something like that it's always going to look perfect uh and this guy looks like he's got his life together and everything is going well for him uh, and to part of that is being organized and downloading antivirus, you know, that's part of the lifestyle they're representing here. 
And once again, we have the testimonials. As you can see, we're starting to see a pattern across uh, antivirus landing pages. And actually, the same techniques work everywhere. You know, it's really funny. Once you know how these things work, you see the, exactly the same things on every page. Here are the testimonials, just like on the uh, Avira page. Testimonials here. Here we have the, uh, the, the happy couple. Here we have the testimonials. And we, here we have the happy couple. So you can see they use exactly the same formula um, as each other, which is really quite interesting. Now, actually, the AVG doesn't have quite the same formula, but it's similar. Um, instead of the image here, they've gone with a girl. Now, she, again, once again, we have another model, right? She's not overweight. She's not ugly. You know, she seems happy and content. She's very nicely dressed. The room around her looks like she lives in a nice apartment and she's quite wealthy, you know, not not incredibly wealthy to, as to be um, as to be so, so wealthy that we can't relate with the the image, but just enough. So it's something we the everyday person could attain uh, drinking a cup of tea. And she looks like generally she has her life together. And of course, the assumption is that she has AVG antivirus. Um, and that's part of the reason why she lives such a great life, okay? And then you, you're gonna scroll, we have this at the top of the page, excuse me, and we're gonna scroll the rest of this page uh, in the correct buying mood, right? We're gonna scroll the rest of this page in a mood, in the right mood. Okay, uh, please go away, okay. Um, we've got the side-by-side -side here. The basic antivirus is in gray, dull colors, right? Uh, of course, the truth is they don't really want people to download the, the, the basic version. They want people to download the full version. They've called it unlimited, but there's, there's, I mean, the basic version is also unlimited. There's no limit on how much you can use it. So this is a strange, misleading kind of word to be using because both of these are unlimited, right? They're not going to run out. Um, we have the huge difference in the number of uh, checkpoints. This visual is, makes it very tempting to go and click buy now down here. And we have a nice money back guarantee. Uh, of course, yes, the money back guarantee is possible. But the truth is, is that most people, right? If they buy this, let's say somebody buys this thinking, okay, well, I'll buy it, but who cares? Because I can just get a money back guarantee uh, afterwards. Of course, most of those people don't actually claim the money back guarantee, right? And that's why they put it there because they know very few people will actually claim it. Um, they know not many people are gonna go through the effort. They'll probably just stick with it because people are busy and people are lazy, right? Um, and then once again, we have the awards just like the other ones as well. Okay, award winning. And here's the last antivirus we're gonna look at. This is Norton. Now they've gone with a diff bit of a different approach, but once again, they have the multicultural image of an Asian family. And this time they've gone with the parent-father relationship. Uh, look at, and once again, we have the pop-up. Uh, we have uh, the big yellow box for the answer they want you to click and the small boring writing for the answer they don't want you to click. And so once again, we have this image and, and what again, what does a child and a father really have to do with antivirus? Not much. I mean, I suppose, no, I, I can't. It's, this is not child protection software. This is antivirus. Okay, security technology. So I suppose there is a kind of link. I suppose there might be parental controls on this antivirus, and, but still it's, a, it's not, <laughs> You know, it's, it's not an image that really links to the product very well at all. And here we have a, a man with a dog. And once again, it's not an ugly man. It's not an overweight man. It's a pretty good looking man. Uh, he got, we're holding his dog. Um, but not only that, he's wearing his glasses and he seems very put together, right? He's not messy, he's not scruffy, he's put together. And part of that identity that is relating with us is that, uh, he downloads the correct antivirus. Um, we have once again another image here. Now this girl again is very good looking. She doesn't look perfect, but she she looks uh, 
no, she's a model, I think, actually. She, again, she's wearing glasses and she looks very well put together in nice clothes, nice um, accessories on her wrist. And she looks like a successful person, right? She looks very well put together. And once again, if, if you want to be like this girl, you will download this antivirus to, make, to put your life together, right? It's to keep yourself secure and safe from viruses. And outside of that, is to make your life more organized and put together just like this girl here okay uh and we have exactly the same thing here once again we have a successful looking woman with her high heels up on the desk pretty good looking again not fat not ugly attractive woman um and her desk well it is a bit cluttered but it's cluttered in a kind of like a kind of organized way, you know, uh, she looks like a successful modern businesswoman, uh, in my opinion, even though she does have her feet up on the desk. That doesn't take away from that. And here we have the man once again, wearing glasses, once away, once again, not fat, not ugly, uh, nice accessory watch on his wrist with a cup of tea. This seems to be a, a theme going along, having cups of tea or cups of coffee or whatever. Um, Again, he seems very well put together. Uh, and on the side, we have uh, uh, we have a table and we have a nice middle-class looking back kitchen there. Okay, he's not living in a, cra in a crappy place, he's living in a nice place. Next image, once again, a middle-class, not, uh, not fat, not ugly, a uh, white woman uh, looking very well put together as usual. Looking through her th phone and this time smiling as if something is really, really interesting and happy on there so that's all the images i'm going to look at i just thought i would show you that because it's quite interesting and and that's it so see you later guys bye bye